Hello everyone and welcome to another video here on our channel. This is Myrtle Ramos, the founder of Blocktides and also the official influencer of CoinMarketCap. We are here to provide the latest news and updates in the blockchain and crypto space as well as some information. Hello everyone and welcome to another video here on our channel. This is Myrtle Ramos, the founder of Blocktides and also the official influencer of CoinMarketCap. We are here to provide the latest news and updates in the blockchain and crypto space as well as some information. So let's start. So our topic today is actually how to secure your assets. So 10 tips how to secure your assets assets okay so first is actually use a cold wallet okay so unlike hot wallets cold wallets do not connect to the internet therefore they are prone to cyber attacks okay so storing your private keys in a cold wallet also known as the hardware wallet as we call it is the most viable of course option as these come encrypted so keeping your keys at the same time secure so the second one is use a secure internet we all know that we have internet in our household so while trading or making crypto transactions always use only a secure internet okay so uh, it is very important and avoid public wi-fi so even when accessing um what do you call this your home network you can uh, I we really do uh, recommend for you to use a VPN for additional security because a VPN changes your IP address and location so keeping your browsing activity safe and private from threat actors so the third one is to maintain multiple wallets so me I do have like five uh, two exchanges and then three wallets so since there is no limitation for wallet creation you can definitely diversify your cryptocurrency uh, your cryptocurrency investments in multiple wallets okay so use one wallet for your daily transactions and uh, keep the rest in a separate wallet and that def definitely will protect your portfolio and mitigate the loss of any breach to your crypto okay so the fourth one so the fourth tip that we have is secure your personal device so when securing your personal devices guys make sure your personal device is up to date with the latest virus uh, definitions to of course defend against newly discovered uh, vulnerabilities so not all technologies are perfect and we all know that and please we do recommend to use a strong antivirus and firewall to improve your uh, of course devices security to avoid hackers from taking advantage of the weaknesses by writing code to target the vulnerability of course so it's very important so uh, number six is don't get pished pished okay so phishing scams as we all know i do get a lot of emails about that so uh phishing scams uh, via malicious ads and e emails are rampant already in the cryptocurrency world so be careful while making crypto transactions as well as avoid at all costs any suspicious and unknown links okay so the seventh tip that we have is don't use the same password uh, we all know that me uh, i do forget a lot of things but of course it's recommended for you to not use the same passwords at the same time number eight is to check the url locks what are url locks so when using a web wallet so you should definitely secure and ensure that there is an ssl i've worked with godaddy before so ssl is a security mark in the addresses 
window of your browser. So this stands for a secure site seal and ensures that your browsing is encrypted. So we also have that in Blocktide's website. So the ninth tip is actually avoid storing a large large portion of your crypto on exchange wallets so while a lot of exchanges out there that are cu currently leading the market are considered safe and even uh, insurance uh, even though they, they they do have insurance of course um <clears throat> it is considered safe uh, when it's never uh, i mean, what i meant is it's never a wise idea to leave the bulk of your crypto on exchanges or wallets okay so diversify at the same time <clears throat> it's just a recommendation okay so number 10 is very important so um, I noticed with a lot of people but please don't post your earnings online it's a digital timestamp so it's also for your security so to recap for everything guys um, with what I said it's just a quick video the cryptocurrency industry is constantly evolving at the same time it is your sole responsibility to protect all of your funds all of your digital funds by securing your wallet with essential safety precaution so update yourself with the latest uh, security news uh, attack techniques and of course prevention strategies it's very best so keep safe guys not just uh, with the covid situation that we have but also with your cryptocurrency holdings okay so see you in the next video if uh, of course if you like this don't forget to hit the like button and the subscribe and hit that notification bell so you'll be notified with our uh, new videos okay so i'll see you in the next video keep safe and i'll see you soon ciao